Hey, what's up, viewers? How's it going? Today is Friday. What do you guys got planned for the weekend? So in my last video, I asked you, what would you do if you won $100 million? And this is what you guys said on YouTube and on Facebook. Today's question of the day is, what is your favorite food? And just to let you guys know, if you want to connect with me through Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram, links are down below. And I try my very best to reply back to everybody. Okay, so first story of the day comes from a mom who decided to breastfeed in public. She was at a recreation center in Burleson, Texas. She was breastfeeding her 16-day-old baby while waiting for her older daughter to finish up with Dan. Dance class. Well, one of the employees who works there thought that is unacceptable. She came up to the breastfeeding mother and told her she has to cover up or leave. The mother stood up for herself and said, it's state law. I can nurse my child with or without cover up in public. And guess what? She's right. Breastfeeding is allowed in public in all 50 states in America. The employee kept telling her, have some decency and cover up. But the mother wasn't going anywhere. And this is when the husband took out his camera and filmed the whole thing. The husband thought it was wrong that this employee was coming up to his wife and telling her to cover up. So we uploaded the video to YouTube and it's called Breastfeeding Discrimination, Burleson Recreation Center. And she was actually the second mom who was asked to cover up at this recreation center. This story became so big that the city of Burleson was forced to release a statement. And they said the city supports the law. A mother is entitled to breastfeed her baby in any location, which includes a public location and recreational centers. So I guess in your face, employee of the recreational center. What do you viewers think? Should women be allowed to actually breastfeed their babies in public? Okay, let me take you guys over to South Miami, where this guy right here, Derek Medina, posted pictures on Facebook of his dead wife. Who does that? He said, rest in peace, Jennifer Alfranzo. The image was of his wife in leggings just on the floor in his kitchen. He said as a description on the picture, you guys are going to see me on the news. And that was just after he confessed to killing her. Before he posted the picture, he had this to say on Facebook. I'm going to prison or death sentence for killing my wife. Take care, Facebook people. My wife was punching me and I'm not going to stand for the abuse anymore. So I did what I did. I hope you understand. Is this guy messed up or what? How about you go out there and file for a divorce? And then guess what? You're never going to have to see her again. Derek told investigators that he grabbed a gun from his closet and he decided to confront his wife about all the abuse. And this is when she grabbed a knife to try to defend herself. Well, Derek was able to grab the knife and disarm her. So he took the gun, aimed it at her, and just kept shooting. When the police arrived at the house, they just found the wife just dead on the ground. And also, they found their 10-year-old daughter upstairs unharmed. What do you guys think of this messed up story? And what should happen to this guy? There has been so many messed up stories in the news, but that's all the news stories I have for you guys today. I'll see you guys in my next video.